to A Conversation on Cleansing. I'm Dr. Marisol Tajiro. And I'm Dr. Melissa Wilms, and we are your Cleanse Curators. We're here with Michelle Schmidt of doTERRA Essential Oils, and Michelle's going to give us some tips on how to naturally support your immune system using the essential oils. Neat. Great. These essential oils are so pure and therapeutically potent. Um, one drop of On Guard, which is a mixture of um, clove and cinnamon and wild orange rosemary eucalyptus. Oh, it smells mm -hmm. amazing. Yeah. yeah. Melissa yeah. wants to use it for perfume. We can make the house smell great and kill airborne pathogens by putting a few drops in your mm -hmm. diffuser. That's what I do with when coughs and colds happen in the household. Yeah. When the kids go back to school yeah, and they exactly. become little petri dishes yeah. of infection, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. For September. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> um, as we well know, um, viruses, they live in the inside of our cells. And that's why if you go to the doctor and you get a, an antibiotic, that's why he sends you home. They an antibiotic won't get rid of a virus. Mm -hmm. So, natural combination of tea tree and oregano essential oil, um, they lice the cell, they break it down and kill the virus. Excellent, wow. yeah. Now, these essential oils are so strong that when you are taking them, especially oregano oil, mm -hmm. you need to make sure that in between of the doses you're taking probiotics and a, mm -hmm. a probiotic that's approved. Because yeah. if not, you can also, this, this kills back, it's such a good antibacterial yeah. that can also kill the good bacteria that we want to yeah. help us long term mm -hmm. have a healthy yeah. immune system, exactly. right? And so, yeah. how would you take these essential oils? Yeah, how how to that. yeah Dr. Marisol is saying how it is so potent. Yeah. Oregano is very strong. Anybody that's taken that mm -hmm. knows. Maybe it burns, maybe you just want to chuck a little bit of juice or water yeah. after it. Um, you can buy um, capsules, em empty oh. capsules, and yeah. you can add a couple drops oh, of the oil smart. to the capsules and swallow them there for it if it yeah. gets too much. Um, to take it just a drop orally. Excellent. So what yeah. a great tool. But of course, we all know there's also some other things that you need to do to have a good, healthy immune system throughout the year, which are things like, what would you say, Dr. Melissa? Making sure you're well hydrated, mm -hmm. right? Lots yeah. of water, lots of tea. Uh, we love our green tea. We love rooibos tea. Uh, anything to keep the body hydrated and the immune system in shape. What else? Good nutrition, of course. Uh, stocking up on those vegetables, green leafy vegetables. And of course, you know, having healthy amounts of protein, which people tend to forget. Usually you need about one gram per kilogram of body weight, and if you don't have enough protein, you won't have a healthy immune system. Absolutely. Right? Sleep Other is tips? also really, really important, mm -hmm. right? Your immune system works really, really hard at nighttime. The body's repairing itself. So making sure you're getting into a deep REM level sleep, uh, that's another good one. Stress reducing, right? Mm -hmm. Too much stress can really impact the immune mm -hmm. system. And so exercise. And exercise, yeah. exactly. If you don't have healthy amounts of exercise in your life, you'll probably be more stressed out. <laughs> so make sure to have a, a good life practice and a good cleansing health practice that you, you follow all those tips and then these these are just excellent additions for when you do get under the weather. Absolutely. Perfect. Great. Thank you for joining us today for a conversation on cleansing. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.